Well, happening this weekend, your chance to be German. <laughs> German Fest returns to Milwaukee's lakefront. Our Pete Zervakis is live now as we look ahead to this popular event. Hi, Pete. Well, Susan Vince, uh, last half hour we had dancers. This half hour we got uh, music. We're getting serenaded by, I believe this is an Alphorn. I'm joined now by Eric Rudy from German Fest. Can you tell us a little bit about what we're listening to? So this is an Alphorn, and then we have an accordion in the background providing some nice background music. And they would play this in the mountains, and it would reflect off the mountains, just like it does sort of off the stage. Now, obviously, you mentioned to me you're from the Milwaukee area. Uh, what does German culture mean to this area? Obviously, very strong German tradition here. Right. Well, Milwaukee is sometimes called German Athens. So it, it was, in the 1800s, very culturally German. You drive through the city, all the architecture. We had lots of German restaurants, beer gardens everywhere. Now they're coming back, which is outstanding. But uh, here we have over 35 clubs, different German clubs, all have different cultural aspects dancing, genealogy, tradition. I, I, Milwaukee's German. <laughs> Eric, thank you so much for your time this morning and for, for the awesome music that we're listening to. Vince, Susan, German Fest runs all weekend here at Henry Meyer Festival Park, and today it's only $3 to get in. What a deal, Pete. Thanks very much. It's fine.